Hey, sorry about that Sable thing. I should have told you earlier, but it all happened so fast. It's okay. We're still best buds. We're not best buds. Well, that took a dark turn. Anyway, Sable has the mayor's ear and unchecked authority. We've searched that address you gave me, found plenty of evidence of a bomb plot, but nothing that leads back to Martin Lee. I'm working on that. Hey, MJ. Hey, so I dredged up some records on Martin Lee's other business holdings. He's got places all over the city. Huh. The locations line up with a map I found at that shipping business. I'll check them out. Let me know what you find at each one, and I'll work on building a case. You got it. I'm headed to Lee's office at Feast to see if I can learn more about why he's doing this. And what he's got planned next. Okay. Say hi to May for me. Wait, you don't think she's in danger, do you? No. Lee's only got one target on his mind. Norman Osborne. Howard, long time no see. How's Pidgey do? He's a little down today. Misses his cousins. Been a bit of a whirlwind for both of us. Owners of my building, rezoned for commercial. We had to move into Feast to get our bearings. I'm so sorry. New York landlords can really be heartless. When they kicked me out of my place, they set all my birds loose. Pidgey's the only one who found me. I've been looking everywhere for the rest of them. But with my bad leg and all... You know what? I'd get around. How about I keep an eye out for him? You do that? Oh, thank you. If you have any luck, please give me a call. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? <laughs> Me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to, uh, stay busy. Might help him, too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? Just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. Is this the same game or a different one? They blur together. I get tired of winning. You mean tired of me winning? Hey, Eileen, May said your daughter reached out. Yeah, she was worried I died in the blast and wants to reconnect. I don't know. It never worked out before. You gotta take these things slow. Rebuild the trust. It'll work, I know it. Be nice if something good came from this. Any news about Mr. Lee, Pete? You hear anything, you tell us. I'll try to find out. I knew a man who can handle the Round City Hall. I still haven't seen him.
Need help with those veggies? I learned a long time ago, you're more help staying out of the kitchen than in it. Pete, glad to see you're okay. Hanging in there. Hmm, this office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. I don't feel safe anymore. seen that room before. Whoa, what the... High voltage lines. What needs this much power? I understand, but the account number is in Mr. Lee's office, which is inaccessible. I will call you back as soon as I can get that information. No, I don't know when that will be. What would Ben do? Lee did so much for New York. I can't believe he was hiding such darkness inside him. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. This is the ghost story Lee's father read to him. About a demon that could only be mastered through balance. Lee's journal. A key. I wonder where the lock is. Huh. The shrine in the photo is missing the picture. Hmm. Some kind of puzzle lock. That seems right. Oh, I see. What are you hiding, Lee? Lee's giving his powers to the- Lee sure is obsessed with masks. Is it a Jungian thing? Like, he needed to pretend to be someone else to let his darkest feelings out? Pretended to be a demon, until he became one. How does Lee imbue these with his power? Bioelectric induction? Compressed phase shift? Can feel my power growing. Feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Whoa. This is the 
folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Phew. It's a burn room, wired to destroy evidence. Okay, through the floor grate. <laughs> now, how do I get out of here? Hello, Peter. Mr. Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. Can get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. And an Osborne rally. I didn't know you were a fan. Well, what matters is, you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? Oh, I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. MJ, hey. Just checking in. Peter, hey. Can I call you back? I think you'll want to hear this. Wait, why are you whispering? Just in the middle of something. How about we catch up over dinner? My place? Oh, sure. I'll even cook. Cool. See ya. Wait. Remember how you told me about Lee's corrupting touch? I think I just saw it in action. How? Some perfectly nice homeless people just jumped me. Thing is, they had glowing eyes. And I remembered Yuri telling me something similar about the guard who released Shocker. So Shocker was working for Lee? Uh, it's all connected. There's more. But I guess we'll talk about it at dinner. <laughs> 